Hey everybody, welcome back. All right, so we just got the Flaming Greatsword. Uh, and here's our new inventory since we were robbed of everything else. And uh, I'm curious, is there, is there a lever in this other room? I don't think that there is, but if there was, maybe we could try telekinesis to get this thing open. I don't think there is, though. No. I believe, if I'm not mistaken, that the other side over here, you get there by uh, doing the stupid platforming section in the marketplace. I think that's how you get to that side. Uh, oh, look, there's a box. We're going to take this. Hold on, let me get rid of this Gandalf pipe and that whetstone or whatever that is. And uh, what we'll do is put our crystals in here and our upgrade sphere. Eh, why not this thing, too? There you go. All right. So back down into the marketplace sewers we go. And we're just going to uh, wander around and kill some things, I guess. This is not looking promising here. I know we made it across once, but I don't trust this a second time. Let me see if I can get a better... Oh, that's fantastic. Alright, we almost fell, but uh, we didn't, so there you go. No big deal, no problem. Alright, so yeah, again, we're just going to kind of wander around and kill some things, and if we find an exit back up to the marketplace, we'll take it. Okay, there's a regular ghoul. And a possessed skeleton. Alright, I was going to look at... Uh, what was I going to look at? No? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're working on loyalty, that's right. Once we learn loyalty, we'll be able to get ourselves a minion, so in effect, a replacement Darren. And in the past, it was always my experience that the minions were always better than Darren anyway. But in order to get a minion, they have to be affected by uh, mind thaumaturgy. And the way that you determine that is by using continuous mind sense or just temporary mind sense. So we'll have to use temporary mind sense because we're already using two bindings right now. And continuous mind sense is a third binding. But loyalty is a binding. So you see the issue. See what's going on down here. Uh, is there nothing in here? Nothing in here. Let's see, was this the... No, this is a different spot. I thought it might... I was like, how could we be back at the place where we found those consumables? Well, we're not. There's a skeleton right here. Ooh, that was nice. Oh man, which way to go? I have no idea. Let's go this way, I guess. Is there anything over there? No. Yeah, I don't think so. I don't think so. You're not face-hugging me. might be able to... Well, one thing, you cannot minionize 
any of the creatures in the sewers that I'm aware of. But I was just thinking, some of the uh, zombies in the new level, the gentry, we could definitely minionize them. Uh, there's another blue crystal. I have absolutely no use for it, but that's still good. This is not... nope, nope, that's a uh, dead end. Alright, so how about this way? This looks more promising. Yeah, this is a way out right here. And again, there's... In the marketplace, there's not anyone to minionize either, except maybe one person, but they're at the end of the platforming area, and we're not doing the platforming thing because it's stupid. Uh oh. Alright. Whoops. I don't know how we <laughs> I don't know how we hit him. But this is not looking good. You know, if I could ever stand up, that would be great. Oh, for God's sake. If I could ever stand... How come they're not falling? Oh, good. Oh, good. And I can't even swing the weapon, even if I wasn't falling everywhere. Are you kidding me? That was, among all of the really just stupid things that have happened in this run... That was the stupidest. I, I just could not stand up or stay standing up for any amount of time. Give me a break, man. Ugh. Let's get out of here. I hate this place. And luckily I know exactly where we are. And we're not far from a way out. But there's still a problem. And the problem is that I don't remember where this particular exit is going to take us. I think it I think it's going to take us to the to the golem halls maybe. I can't remember. Oh, will you die already? Yeah, again, can't remember where this particular exit's going to take us. I'm trying to remember. Hmm. It might be the Golem Halls. We're about to find out. Uh, oh no, to Sir's level, that's right. Actually, this is fine, unless we run into Sir. But no, this is fine, because we can get right back to the crossroads, which is where we need to be. Yeah, no problem. No problem. So now we can go to the gentry. And hopefully by the time we get there, we will have learned loyalty. And we can get ourselves a companion because our health is not looking good and we have no sats. So we need a meat shield, basically.
Okay. So first of all, we're going to open the door. Secondly, we're going to reactivate strikes. But not shell. No, not shell. Instead, we're going to... We're going to use continuous mind sense. It's just going to be easier that way. And that way we'll be able to see... I, I mean, it's not even really necessary because I know... I know I can use thaumaturgy, mind thaumaturgy on these guys. It's really not necessary, but... Yeah, we just learned it. We just learned That's beautiful timing. So there's loyalty. And... All right, so that's number eight. So you just have to put the mouse over somebody's head and press the corresponding button to minionize them. And But here's the issue. First of all, let's work on uh, confusion. The issue is we haven't learned continuity three yet, so I have to turn mind sense off, actually. But again, it's fine. Just put the mouse over somebody's head and we'll be good. But the question is, who's going to be the best minion? And I don't know yet. So there's a bunch of guys in here. So I'd like to see who's got like the best setup going on. Oh, okay, I didn't even see the dude run out. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. Whoever's left standing becomes the minion. I guess. Or I might just die. Yep, I'm probably gonna die. Then die. Yeah, this is great. You are the minion. You with the shield. Help me. Did he just kill my minion? No, he didn't kill him. Alright, minion, help me out here. Okay. okay. You know, if we were to... Alright, if we turn strikes off, we can get a second minion. I'm turning strikes off. We're gonna die anyway, who cares? Uh, so we got one minion with a mace and a shield. And that's nice and all. Uh, but we gotta find something better. Let me see if we can get some better gear going here. Like that Lamellar, and these Queis, and these Spalders, and these Van Braces, and the gloves. He's already got a decent helmet. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Oh, he's attacking me. Okay, he just turned on me after I just gave him a bunch of gear. Okay, well, so, here's the thing. With minions, they usually only turn on you if you attack them, or if you kill other creatures that they're, for whatever reason, aligned with. And we just killed all those dudes, and he didn't get mad. So, instead, I give him some good gear, and he gets mad. So, I, I can't win, okay? I can't win. So, here's a new minion right here. Nope, I don't have enough mana. He doesn't look like he's going to be a good minion anyway. Let's try it again. There we go. So now he is minionized. And I've learned continuity 3. I'm going to put strikes back on. No, I'm not because I don't have any mana. Let's see how long it takes before he turns on me. You know, if I put Mind Sense on, I'll know when he turns on me because his mind state will turn yellow from blue. Well, that's not... Well, it'll turn yellow or red when there's no enemies around. All right, let's see if he'll uh, let's see what's gonna happen. This is interesting. Let's see if he gets. He might turn on you. Also, actually, that's stupid because you know when they turn on you because the binding disappears. The purple part here. All right, it did not disappear, so he did not turn on me yet. I just wish I had enough mana right now to do what I need to do, but I don't. 
All right. Uh, okay, so we learned continuity three. Uh, we're going to work on dual wield over here. And that just goes back in here. All right, well, we might as well go back this way. So those are just bathrooms. Oh, come on, man. I mean, we could go hog wild and have three minions. But again, we'd have to wait for all the, the mana to restore. And the mana bar disappears sometimes, so I'd have to go into combat mode to see it. And it's kind of irritating. I'd like to have an option whether or not to keep it always visible. I was really hoping for a salve. Of course, we could heal uh, our red damage with our socketed mask if it hadn't have disappeared. That would be nice. All right. Uh, let's go out this way. Hello, future minion. You are now minionized. All right. Now they should not turn on each other because they're both zombies. They're not from different, you know, not different types of creatures or whatever. Is there anything out here? No. You know, I miss having minions. I've been focusing so much on Force Thaum these days instead of Mind Thaumaturgy just because the Force Thaumaturgy is new. It's a problem with Darren, though, because what often happens is your minion and Darren will start fighting. And it gets, it gets obnoxious. But we don't have that problem because Darren is dead, which is a wonderful thing in so many ways. Whoa! Minions, attack! Come on, man. I shouldn't have to do anything. There we go. There we go. Keep it going. Now, granted, my minions don't have the best weapons or the best gear, but it's fine. They still handled it. That's what I like to see. Come on, man. Give me a salve. Okay. No, they, they don't want to give me a sap. Where'd the other minion go, by the way? That slacker. There he is. Let's go down this way. There's nothing in there. I'm running into the minion. They might, might end up having him turn against me if I do that too often. Let's get out of here. There's not enough room. I don't like it. Oh, it's an Eldritch Knight. Minions, protect me. Uh-oh. Yeah, we're in trouble. We are in trouble here. I don't think you can minionize this guy. Oh, we just minionized him. But he's killing my other minions. I don't care. Killed him. 
I don't mind kill them. See, they're not the same type of creature. The the Eldritch Knight is different from these guys. You have been fired. You are fired. I didn't think you'd be able to minionize the Eldritch Knight. That's amazing. Now, how can the Eldritch Knight be having any trouble here? Oh, yeah, we've got an Eldritch Knight for a minion. That is what I am talking about. All right, so this is where we're going to end this episode. Thank you, as always, for hanging out, everybody. I appreciate it. Please hit like and subscribe, and I will see you all next time.